Good day ladies and gentlemen, how are you guys doing today? Welcome to Sivanos HD. If this is your first time here, kindly click on the red subscribe button to subscribe to this channel and also click on the bell icon for notifications. So whenever I drop new videos, you'll be updated and notified. Don't also forget to connect with me on Instagram with at masterblessed. I really, really appreciate that. So go over to Instagram and connect with me. David Doe signs Mr. Medi into his record label, DMW. Also, Oshpapi was allegedly denied bail and also allegedly sacks his Chicago-based lawyer, Gal Pizetsky. But wait, before we get into those stories, there is this tweet of um, Bishop Odiedepo I saw on Twitter where he tweeted that Titan is an inescapable covenant obligation. Prosperity, not just wealth, is impossible without Titan because when you are not paying your tithe, you are under a financial cost. I've been asking people personally what they think about it. So, so I decided to bring it here and ask you guys, guys, what do you think about this? Let us know your opinion in the comment section. Now to one of the main stories of today, David Doe signs Mr. Medi into his record label, DMW. Popular Nigerian singer and music executive, David Adeleke, popularly known as David Doe, has signed Mr. Medi into his record label, DMW. Medi disclosed this in a post he made on his verified Instagram page today, July 18th. The DMW latest signee took to his page in excitement and wrote, my new family, I'm so excited, problem, DMW, 30BG, confirmment. A scroll on his Instagram page actually revealed that Davido and Medi have both been in touch over the past days. A recent video on Medi's page also revealed they have shot a video together for one of his songs. Many big names in Nigeria entertainment industry, especially the music industry, have taken to their pages and Insta story to congratulate Mr. Medi. However, as at the time of making this video, no official statement or post has been made by Davido. In regards to Medi signing, Medi was formally signed by P Square into Square Records before things fell apart for them. Huh? Davido they offline they do things, online they do things. Wow, God bless Davido. Still on the update, Whiskey thanks his fans for wishing him a happy birthday. Nigerian singer and superstar Whiskey has taken to Instagram to thank his fans after he was celebrated massively on his 30th birthday. The award-winning musician turned 30 yesterday and all social media platforms were filled with touching tributes to the young legend who has been a massive blessing to the Nigerian entertainment industry. Celebrities, fans and well-wishers showered praises on the legend for his contribution to the music industry. In a recent update on the singer's Instagram page some moments ago, the singer revealed that he can't feel his face. He also thanks his fans for the love in another post. Also, still on Whiskey, lovely videos and photos from his 30th birthday has also surfaced online. The low-key party that was sponsored by Siroc had Whiskey's inner circle in full attendance as they celebrate the living legend on his big day. The singer celebrated his birthday on 16th July 2020 and it has Mary making each and every day. According to sources, his friends he worked with on his Made in Lagos album threw a surprise birthday party for him. A video shared by party attendees sees his friends present him with a birthday cake while singing the popular happy birthday song for him. Another video also shows him pop a bottle of champagne and dance to his new age. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, yeah, with you. Happy birthday to you. Hey, hey. 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 Hey, hey.
Hush Puppy, a Nigerian Instagram personality who is facing cyber fraud allegation in the United States, has disengaged Carl Pizetsky, his lawyer in Chicago, after his trial was transferred to California. The self-acclaimed influencer, whose real name is Ramon Igbalode, had been arranged in Chicago on money laundering charges following his arrest in Dubai and subsequent extradition to the US. He had also hired the top lawyer who immediately took up his defense. Hush Puppy was however denied bail in a Chicago hearing with a judge ruling that he will remain detained until his trial later this year. According to Premium Times, documents showed that Igbalode's case has been transferred to the Central District of California for prosecution. It was gathered that the transfer had come after the US government orally renewed its motion for removal in custody and the motion was granted during the detention hearing on Monday. It is also understood from the commitment letter sent to California that Hush Puppy has refused to retain Pizetsky as his attorney, requesting that a court-appointed counsel be assigned to him. Now his lawyer Gal Pizetsky has now come out to say that this news is false and he hasn't been sacked by Hush Puppy. This is what he posted on Instagram. He posted a screenshot of Premium Times report and captioned it, fake news. I will be representing Hush Puppy in Los Angeles. And many other facts in this terrible article are fake news. Also, here is what Hush Puppy's biggest fan has to say to him. Really? Hush Puppy, you blasted it, babe. You not be a woo boy. You be sensible boy. Your brain, it pass computer. Yeah. It pass rats. It pass cockroach. It pass mosquito. Anywhere where you there, Hush Puppy. Nothing go do you. Even though you know fuck for one year, money for your belly back it, back it. A cop, they go here. All the boys, big boys, Canada, USA. They will go carry with guy for USA come. I'm blast the computer. And Dubai do. He pass here, who? Dubai said we go buy Dubai. Yeah. Or even man make it wise. No be today when una de tip pa wa oye. No be today una de tip pa wa kudo oye. Nah, they use computer te shine the eye yo. Hush puppy. US, the whole US where they get an alternative brain. Hush puppy, use them egg. Hush puppy, bro, see too much. You get that when they. I take a letter. Who boys? They see that virus money. Who they don't even talk with country. Oh they know this guy. I don't just know this intelligent guy. He move the whole full country money. <laughs> Where can I enter? Yeah? Where can the money enter? Cause South Africa go lodge again. Different, different corner, corner. <laughs> <laughs> Where you guys you too? Oh, <laughs> Nixon and Sami have been more than carrying a grandfather come up for you. What do you think about these guys? Let us know your opinion in the comment section. Still on the update, Nigerian lady laments after ordering for her iPhone 11 Pro online, but but instead she received the Aba Android version. The phone normally costs 650k, but the online vendor sold it for her around 230k. Here's a video clip of her showing off the phone. <laughs> Roll it. Mm. This is the phone. I uh, swipe it up. A little bit button. The phone even has. Play store. You don't have play store. Play store. In her hair. Another other. Let me see. See. See as it's in. The phone gets. She's got a bit of power on her face. See camera. They got a bit of portraits and everything. In Bajay, they have a bit of portraits. What's this? 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't hear you. 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 I will not be safe for me. I will be safe for That is all for this video, guys. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to slap a like on this video. Click on the red subscribe button to subscribe to this channel as always. And also click on the bell icon for notifications. So whenever I drop new videos, you'll be updated and notified. Don't forget to connect with me on Instagram with Bless. I really, really appreciate that. So go back to Instagram and follow me over there. Take care, guys. Stay safe. I'll see you later for another video. And peace.